hello guys once again i'm here it's your boy black panther coming to you with another episode of yadel confessions so today i'm going to read another story and this is my first time reading it as usual i'll be reading it and reacting alongside so i hope you guys enjoy it if you if this is the first time you're seeing make sure you check my other videos and leave a comment Shout outs to the admins of Jodel Arena on Telegram. Here we go. So this is my story. It's not me, I beg. It's not me. I'm reading. So this is my story. I work in a guest house as a reception. Houston, we have a problem. In SCC1, VC1, in the beginning. In the, in the bini, in the biningging, yeah, in the, in, in, uh, in the, listen properly, in, in the biningging, yeah, in, in, in the biningging, in the biningging, in, in, in the, in, in the biningging. So this is my story. I work in a guest house as a receptionist and due to some reasons I can I only do night shift. Last two weeks some married man be then in Saichi can book room. So basically a married man and a Saichi came to book a room. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. So a man and a lady came to book a room. We can't just assume. So let's just let's just give it as it is. And before we book and before we book, we ask ask for your details, example name and number. But this man refused to give his details. I tried to explain but he never did while explaining things to the while explaining things to the man the lady was also giving me an eye and as a receptionist for being a nice by giving her the same energy hold up just wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute say hold up wait a minute, hold up. Wait a minute. something ain't right a man comes to the hotel we hydrate <laughs> So a man comes to the hotel with a girl and asks the receptionist he is trying to get the details of the man to book the room but the lady is eyeing him the receptionist and he's also returning the same energy <laughs> mm. things are getting off on a good start a baby all this while I didn't know the man was seeing the move. Oh I give them the room <laughs> I give <laughs> oh, All this while all this while I didn't know the man was seeing the move. I gave them the room and the man later came back trying to warn me. I couldn't say all he wanted to say because he saw my boss coming. <laughs> I, I see. So he left around 6 p.m. My boss called that there's some food sent where they are. By then the man had left the house. Left to the house. Oh, and they were the only people occupying that space at that time. So I went there and knocked the door to find out. <laughs> so they haven't totally checked out since that there's someone still there the guy left around 6 p.m so i'm not even continuing based on just this 
I guess you you know what is coming. Okay. So he left around six p.m. My boss called that there are some food sent in where they are. By then the man had left to the house. So okay, he went. I went to the to the door to knock to find out. She opened and I asked if there were is any rubbish around so I can help dump it. And she said yes, but I should get her vital milk. She'll gather them before I come back. So if a lady says get get me vital milk maybe, maybe. Let's go. So I went and got her vital milk and took the rubbish she called me back when leaving and said she's not feeling well so i should no. be checking up on her mm. and i said hi okay, okay. Ooh. should i go and work as a receptionist now? <laughs> okay so in about an hour later i went there to ask what was wrong with her and she said headache so i got her some paracetamol and asked if she was eating and she said no but she wants to take porridge before leaving she took my number that she will call me if she needs anything nice hmm i was there around 11 10 pm and then she called dum, 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 dum. <laughs> she called that she wants to see me. I went to them. This girl said she is feeling lonely and wants someone to talk. Hey! But I told her I'm working so I can't leave the place and come and sit here. But I'll close at 11 p.m. So maybe when I close, I can come or not. Then on, this girl said I should promise that I'll come. <laughs> <laughs> Sister, I left her to my duty post. I got a call around 11 p.m. Let me check uh, this girl again. Asking me to get her another Vitamog when coming. So I finally closed at 12 a.m. Closed all the gates and went to see this girl. I sat on the chair while talking to to her like stuff and she asked me to come and sit beside the bed i refused but she forced me how did she force you hmm. my brother how yeah you how can you tell me this story <laughs> it's not that that much force you hmm? <laughs> let's continue i stood on the chair while talking to her like stuff and she asked me to come and sit beside her i refused but she forced me note all this while I was afraid and shaking. Sorry, 23 year old virgin, but virgin. Mm -hmm. I haven't slept with any woman before because I of am this purely virgin. I pray to God, it goes straight to God, okay. and God answered me directly. It's not easy. I'm a purely virgin. I was afraid and shaking on the bed with her, but she put her head on my chest and I can feel she was hot. So I asked her to go get some bath because water is medicine. <laughs> Suddenly you were a doctor, huh? Water is medicine. <laughs> oh my God. This lady was naked in front of me and asking me to come and bath her if you don't get up and go and do it the way i will slap you immediately i was feeling honey but i still helped her with the bath after that we sat on the bed again seriously seriously it's not easy i'm a purely virgin Lord of mercy. Let's continue. 
She realized I was afraid, so she started asking me why I was afraid. Omo, before I opened my mouth to talk to her, Before I opened my mouth to talk, her figure was on my lips, pushed me on the bed, started kissing me like everything was like a movie. Hey, Kla! Kla! Hey! Pono King Kong! So for about 15 minutes into kissing, I pushed her back like, Madam, I can't, even though I wanted to. Like today, dear, I go disburden myself. <laughs> but a lot of things were running through my mind. This is someone I don't even know. So I told her I can't, but she, this lady got bored and was like, she will not forgive me. For what I've done to her. Hey. What did I do wrong? I asked her and she said I should get out. And she will, or she will shout that I want to rape her. <sighs> this is getting serious. Please, I want to ask, what did I do wrong? Was I wrong for not having sex with someone I didn't know? No, you're not totally wrong. We men of these days, we always want to use rape as a defense mechanism. So, the reason why she is doing this because you rejected her. Women fear rejection a lot. And when you reject some, they don't handle it easily. Like how some men also don't handle rejection easily. So in instead of her to accept that, oh, it's not everyone who would want to have sex with me immediately they see me, she resorts to using rape as a means to get you but kudos on initially when I started this thing when I started I thought it to be an interesting but then it's quite annoying per her reaction I hate it when women do such I mean this guy's just being careful he's just being careful and you're there using the rape playing the rape victim well, we haven't heard your side of the story, but I spare him. This is all we know now. But it's annoying when women do that. They will try and seduce you and all. And once you resist or don't show any interest, they will, they will, they will start accusing you and start blackmailing you with the R word. If if you don't if you don't leave me I'm, I'm going to report you to the police and tell them that you me like seriously yo my guy he got my respect initially i was having fun with this but then i mean it's a fun thought it's a fun experience it's, it's a one in a lifetime experience that something like this will happen so every single guy reading probably will get excited as i did and it's a fun story thank you very much for sharing i hope you actually see this video but then keep it up like share subscribe see ya